Good day! This is smartwatchspecifications.com, the premier site for smartwatch specs, news, and reviews. Okay, we are back with our W28 Pro smartwatch. And this time, we are going to install the support app for this wearable. Okay, so this tutorial is all about how to install your W28 Pro with the support app. So what is the support app? So we have here the M Active Pro smartwatch okay so we are going to set up connect the support app for the smartwatch in the android platform okay so if you have any questions regarding the tutorial please drop a comment below and we will try to answer your queries if we do have the time okay so our smartwatch is ready okay so let's check the user manual for the wearable. So let's check if the QR code is available in the user manual. Okay, so let's check. So we have it here. Okay, the QR code. So let's have a closer look. M Active Pro. Okay, available in Android and iOS. Is it available also here in the smartwatch? So let's see. Okay, so we have, I think this is the QR code. So let's check on the settings. Okay, maybe there's a different QR code. Okay, I think this is the QR code. Okay, for our smartwatch or our support app. Okay, so in our support app or in our smartphone, Okay, so let's search for the M Active Pro app in the Google Play Store. Okay, so let's adjust first the screen display. Okay, so let's search for the M Active Pro app. M Active Pro. Okay, so do we have the same? icon here like as you can see okay so it is from Shenzhen and it is 37 MB so let's try let's install the support app okay so I think this will be fast as it is very a very lightweight support app just 37.02 MB as you can see here we are already on our 58% okay so let's wait again this is a step-by-step -step tutorial on how to install or pair your W28 Pro smartwatch to the M Active Pro app so it is also similar okay to other smartwatches that you that is using the same support app okay we are now on the installation of the app Okay, so let's check first our smartwatch. Okay, as you can see here, it is a beautiful Series 8 smartwatch. Okay, with a very slim bezel. Okay, so beautiful looking smartwatch with rotating crown button here. Okay, so seems like we are done. Okay, we do have here the M Active Pro, and as you can see, we are now okay. We have successfully installed the app. Okay, let's open the app. Okay, so here we have a permission allow M Active Pro to access this device's location. Just allow it, allow M Active Pro to make and manage phone calls. Just allow it. Let the app always run a background. Okay, so to avoid any issues first, let's just allow it. Log in with, in with other account. Okay, so here we have the option to log in, visit or log in, sign up. Okay, or you can use third party app here. So let's try this visitors login. Okay. So notification reminder. If you need to forward the application notification to the remote intelligent device, Please press OK. There's no OK. Press OK to enter. Okay. 
So, allow notification access. So, look for the app. We do have here the M Active Pro app. Allow. Okay, going back. So, seems like everything is okay now. Let's check. Let's turn on our Bluetooth here, our GPS, just to make sure. And on the bottom part, we have the device. Just tap on the menu. So, it is now looking for the app. So, let's check. Okay, seems like we do have a connected smartwatch. Okay, so let's go to our Bluetooth connection. Okay, more settings. Let's remove all the application here. Pair devices. Pair. And pair. And pair. Okay, let's clean first our Bluetooth connectivity here. Okay. Okay, so we have an issue previously. As you can see, it's connecting to the other devices, to the previous smartwatch. All you have to do is just clear the cache of the app. Okay, so how do we do that? Just go to the settings, okay? Go to the apps, okay? Manage apps, okay? Select the application, and as you can see here, you can clear the data, okay? So now, we are installing, okay, or pairing a smartwatch from scratch, or it's not looking for other smartwatches okay as you can see here you have not bound any devices yet so let's try and bind the w28 pro smartwatch okay so we have some troubleshooting to do and we have successfully cleared the cache of our application so bind now so allow m active pro to access photos media and files on your device so another permission just allow it allow m active pro to take pictures and record video allow it and it's now searching okay so we have here smartwatch watch 8 but we are not sure if this is a watch 8 this is the watch 8 as we have other smartwatches here that is in the series 8 okay category so let's go and check in our settings okay and tap on about so we have here the Mac 2206-1530-6493. Okay, so I guess this is the smartwatch. So tap on it. Okay, it's now connecting. Let's see. Uh, are we connected? Okay, so we have successfully connected our smartwatch. Okay, so the next step, let's see. Okay, pair with watch call. So, it also wants to activate the Bluetooth okay, functionality of the wearable. So, allow it. Pair. Okay. So, let's check it here. Okay. So, our watch call is connected. Okay. Active. More settings. Okay. So, here it is now connected as you can see. Okay. So going back to the M Active Pro, let's see. Let's tap on find watch. Okay, so it works. Okay, so that's it. On how to pair your M Active Pro up to the W28 Pro Smart Watch. Okay, so if you have any questions regarding the uh, pairing of the wearable to the W28 Pro just drop a comment below and we will try to answer your queries if we do have that time especially in the troubleshooting uh, section okay, of our video okay? as you can see we are having a hard time not really having a hard time but we have some issue in pairing this smartwatch to the wearable okay so we successfully troubleshoot it 
and now we are paired with a smartwatch so again this is smartwatchspecifications.com a premier site for smartwatch specs news and reviews bye